Alright, three, two, one, gamer. <laughs> That's good. Alright, what's up, gamers? Um, I'm yeah. behind in Silent Hill 2 right now. And for some reason, I am ahead. Yep. <laughs> and, uh, the reason why we delayed was because that, uh, I actually updated my, my emulator. Yeah. So, uh, I don't think you actually knew that updating the emulator breaks save states. Oh yeah, I actually, I wasn't aware of that. Yeah, I also learned that out the hard way with, um, Mario, New Super Mario Bros. I literally, I literally just wanted to update my emulator just to fix everything from graphics to cutscenes. I just need I just needed to up to freaking update the cutscenes more importantly because there there were things missing in that game of Xenosaga. Yeah, broken graphics. Yeah, I just hate it when it happens. There's a freaking bug on the ground. <laughs> the funny thing is that when I go up to 4K, it runs well for me. But when I mess around with the settings and just go for a uh, different setting that I forgot what was called, but but I just wanted to go overdrive. Bro, what am I getting? To... Bro, what? I'm fucking stuck. The stupid bug, bro. Oh my god, why did this fucking bug like eat away all my health? I don't even know. But yeah, I just wanted to to make the graphics to go into overdrive. I'm going to uh, reset. <laughs> Why would you want to reset? Because uh, I'm trying to figure out where the fuck to go. And um, this stupid bug just like ate all my health away. Well, that really sucked. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Because I'm on, like, I'm on floor one of one of the buildings. I don't know which one, but I don't have a map for it, apparently. I don't know if I was supposed to find a map for it. Hey, Jay, you want to hear something stupid? What? People are releasing... People are releasing Long Place of Silent Hill really early. Silent Hill 2, the remake, early. I mean, it's out already, right? I think so, yeah. When I look at when I look at the remake, it really looks very unfaithful to the original source material. Or how do I get rid of this stupid bug? And honestly, you know what? Yeah, I think we were just better off playing the original. Yeah, good. <laughs> Because, honestly, I just prefer it that way. It has to be this way. <laughs> oh yeah, it has to. <laughs> Can't get the door open. I don't know where I'm supposed to go in here. But I'm on one of the floor. I'm on the bottom floor. Hey, Zip. I mean, hey, Jacob, you want to hear something funny? What? I'm at this part where I actually have to grab something out of the toilet. <laughs> the toilet. Like, I'm not joking. You literally have to grab something out of the toilet. Oh, damn. Yep, just to find a freaking... Just to find a freaking date. Weird. Yeah, and it's basically clearly stated that... That is actually... He literally found a wallet out of a toilet. Oh yeah, I also have that wallet. But um wait, so hang on. I went there I went there before you did it, but somehow you made more you made like progress elsewhere. Yeah, I did. That's weird. And apparently there's a memo inside the wallet. Hmm. All of these doors are locked. 
I'm actually oh, stuck. I'm actually lost. I don't know where the fuck to go here. I don't. Maybe I'm not even supposed to be on this floor. Where did you find that fucking guy? Because I never found that cutscene. Just, just try to find bathrooms. Bathrooms? Yes. Yeah, try to find a specific bathroom. On what floor? <laughs> Probably the second floor, I think. Second floor? Oh, hey, I found the map. Okay. West apartment building. Oh, thank God, I finally found it. <laughs> Let me try second floor. I don't think I've actually been on the second floor yet. Also, uh, it's capturing my screen still, right? Yeah, good. What you capturing? Uh, just making sure that the screen's still being captured. Can't get ah, the door. Well, that's understandable. <laughs> Thing is, there's just a, there's just a crap ton of floors that like you just can't go on, or you or yeah, you can't go in half these doors. Did I go in f door number two? Did I go in this door already? Isn't this where I found Pyramid Head? Yeah? Yeah, this is where Pyramid Head was. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, so something tells me I'm gonna get very far behind this episode just because I'm kinda lost in this stupid apartment. Why would you ever be lost? Well, because there's not really any, um... There's not really any, like direction. <laughs> Zeppi says Silent Mountain 2. <laughs> I keep wasting my items. Oops. I'm getting, I'm getting used to the controls again. Okay. So yeah, that connects there. I don't think I ever went to the third floor. Ah, oh, let's let's have a look around. That's locked. Okay, so we can't get in there right now. It says two o nine is uh, is uh, unlocked. Nope, never mind. That is uh, that is also locked. Well, the ones that don't have squiggles on them are ones that I can open, but I think I need keys for. Well, why would you need keys for? <laughs> so I can progress. <laughs> okay, let's go in here. Oh, okay. Um, can I go to the third floor? Looks like the lock's broken. Okay. Is there anything even up here? Hmm. Oh, there, there's nothing up here. Okay, never mind then. Okay, maybe I'll try going back on the first floor. Having a map is pretty much essential for this game. Well, yeah, I guess so. Okay, so now I have a map for this place. So it says I can go in 105? I've been in 105 already, I know that. Yeah. So it says one. It says uh, 105 is unlocked and 109 is locked. Weird. Hmm. Now, uh, where should I go? Nope, oh, that's, that's locked. So, 109 is unlocked? There we the go. The door won't open. I don't fucking know where to go, bro. I'm lost. <laughs> You're actually lost? I'm actually lost. I don't know where oh. to go. 
Well, what what items do I even have? Um, I have handgun bullets, the flashlight, um, the coin from the old man. I don't know what you do with that. Do I examine that? No, I don't do anything. All right, well, fuck this. I'm looking up a guide because I got I'm stuck. <laughs> apartment walkthrough because <laughs> I don't know I don't want to be stuck for the next half hour we just might be here all day yep okay so I did the well yeah I never went to the courtyard I'm supposed to go there apparently well I need the courtyard key let's see Um, okay, let's see, um, let's see, checking your map, you head west, you'll find the first, access the apartments, um, Yeah, I did the garbage. I have the coin from the... I have the old man coin. I don't know. I'm gonna maybe leave and go back out. Oh, nice. I found more handgun bullets. So how do I even get out of here? I think I need to go back to the stairs. Like, unless there's something else in 105 that I missed. So I kind of ended the episode in a weird spot. Why would you? Like, I, I'm in the I was in the closet. I don't think there's even anything in 105, though. Like, there's, there's this, there's the save, and that's it. And there's nothing else in here. Well, I also looked at this thing. There, there's this, um... There, there's the five coins. Well, I have an idea. What idea do you have? What if I use the coin on this? Which hole would you like to put it into? Oh. Yeah, I should probably look at my screenshots and see what it says. <laughs> Does it say anything about old man? Something tells me I'm gonna need multiple coins. <laughs> um, let's try the right side. For now, we'll put we'll just put that coin in there. So I'm assuming I need to come back here later with two other coins. Yeah. Okay, and then I need to find my way out of here. Yeah. Okay. We'll see. We'll, we'll get. We'll see. We'll go back outside and see if we can find out how to get to the courtyard. Cause I. I don't. I never went to the courtyard, so I'm probably supposed to go there. Well, I don't know if I have the key for that, so we'll see. We'll find out if I can go there or not. I don't know. I just get. I just get like really frustrated easily when I'm not making progress. So I kind of would like to make some. So let's see. Um, how did I even get here in the first place? I think I need to go in here and then yeah, out this window. I mean, maybe this is one of those situations where you can do things in any order you want. And maybe that's why it seems like I'm behind. Because I haven't got... Because I went to, like, the first floor of the West Side apartment building. And, uh... How do I get out of here again? I need to go to the clock. 
Oh wait, the stairs are right here. Yeah, let's use the stairs. Where are the stairs, anyway? Here. <laughs> Yeah, screw, play screw playing the remake of Silent Hill, we're just gonna play the OG. <laughs> Cause who needs to play remakes, right? Am I right? Okay. So I'm outside now, and, um, you know, I already, I, I already interacted with the garbage. So that's, um, that I don't think has anything now. So what if I tried to go to the courtyard? I think you can go there from here. Okay, maybe not. I could have sworn there was a way to get back there. Hmm. Hmm. You know, All right. right. So right now I just finished watching a cutscene. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So that's why I was just silent. Hell. <laughs> and I saw that from a mile away. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did I for I forgot to grab a key in the pyramid head room? What the fuck? So anyways, I heard what you just said. Yeah. About why. Why what? Why, or why, the, why a remake of this is unnecessary. Well, I mean... I, I just don't feel the need to play the remake, because I've never played the OG. Yeah. I can see that. Where the fuck was the... Oh my god, I'm stupid. I think uh, I need to go back to the pyramid head room. Well, right now, I'm just making progress. Well, let's see. Is it, there's, there's nothing back here, right? No. I don't know how you get to the courtyard. I don't even know where that's at. I've never even seen a courtyard, bro. <laughs> Alright, so why do you need to go to the courtyard for? Well, because you went there. <laughs> and I've never been there before. I don't fuck I don't fucking know where the I'm trying to find the fucking courtyard key. Apparently apparently the courtyard key is in the pyramid headroom and I didn't even notice it. So now I have to go all the way back there and find it. Okay, that's just all the right. gar that's just the garbage again. Find some more key items. Well, I get the idea. We're supposed to find um, we're supposed to find two coins or two more coins because we already have the old man coin, and you have to put them in a specific order. All right, I have the the coin snake. I have the coin old man, and I have the coin prisoner. Yeah, I, I haven't found either of those yet. I'm just, I've only gotten the old man. And from what I'm reading on the guide, it says the snake is in the courtyard, I think. So basically, I only have like... Three out of five coins. No, there's only three coins. There's actually five... Slots of the coins. Yeah, but two slots don't get used. So all you needed is three? Yeah, you just need three coins. Well, I got the three coins. Funnily enough. So, I want to go back to the pyramid head room, I think. If I can remember where that is. Now, oh, 209 is locked. 
Oh, it's in, uh, where is the Pyramid Head room at? It's in, it's in 307. Oh my god, bro. I'm so fucking lost, dude. Fucking sick of this. I'm just having a easy time. I ended in like the worst possible spot last episode. Okay, now I'm gonna use... Where did I find go. where did I find the prison the pyramid head room? It says it's on floor three. Hmm. Yeah, whatever, I'll do a catch up episode. It's fine. You okay with it? Yeah. I mean it's unfortunate. I'm sure you'll catch up really soon. Let's see. Yeah, so it says I need to go back to the clock room. I think. I mean, I guess it's on me for not being thorough enough, but I didn't know there was supposed to be a key in there. So, we go it. No, oh, I guess we can't go in that door. What was the point of this room, then? Nothing? Oh, yeah, yeah, right. We go behind here. Okay, and now we're in 209, so now I can go to the third floor. Think. Like I remember how to get there. Which one of these doors works, bro? Okay, now I can just use one more coin because I made a mistake. Uh, which one of these takes me to the stairs? There we go. Okay, now if I'm correct, this should be able to take me to the third floor. I think? Yeah, okay. I mean, the great thing is that I've killed all the enemies, so I don't really have to worry about that. Oh, well that's good. Okay, so yeah, let's go back to 307. door. That's 307, I think. There we go. There's the courtyard key. That is so dumb. Okay, I'm guessing none of these, these doors have anything in them. Okay. <laughs> I'm making progress. Now I just have to figure out where the the courtyard is so it's let's see um the courtyard key continue past the lying figure to reach the south hall head west you'll find the fire escape key which i have the fire escape key um inside 303 uh ignore the right room that has a lying figure nothing else um east entrance stairwell where do you use where do you use the key exactly? Pass through the one F door by the stairs using the the courtyard key. Okay, so I have to do it on the first floor. Okay, so now I gotta get back to the first floor somehow. I think I can do that by just heading straight here. Yeah. <laughs> 
So, I mean, we're making slight progress. I just gotta figure out how to get to the stairs again. Oh, okay. The stairs are on the other side of the hallway. <laughs> alright, alright. I'm remembering. I'm remembering. I mean, this is a very casual playthrough of Silent Hill. <laughs> And, oh, I, and I also don't know what I'm doing, so... It makes sense there's gonna be a few fuck-ups here and there. I mean, like, you know, like how I missed the rifle in Silent Hill 1. <laughs> I'll never forget the fact that I missed the frickin' rifle. Well, why not? That door's locked. I don't know, like, I the rifle was, like, pretty near... was pretty close by, but I somehow just completely missed it, and then I didn't have it for the whole game. And apparently, it's really way better than the shotgun. So, yeah, that just kind of sucks. Hmm. Did I go in this door already? I think that this is the right door. Yeah. Not sure what's with the with the weird ambience in this room, even though there's nothing in here. I mean, that's just you know typical Silent Hill shit. You know, let's let's play some random creepy ambience for no reason. <laughs> Why no reason? They they just love doing that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hang on a second. So now that I'm on the second floor, this take this can take me to the apartment. Um, but I don't want to do that. I want to go back downstairs. I use these stairs. Okay. So I sh hopefully won't fall too far behind now, because I did find the key, the key. Which means I am kind of catching back up. I'll make a save after I did that. Okay, okay, now. Now I know what I'm doing wrong. Lend, lend me your wisdom. <laughs> okay, here, here's the courtyard. This is what I, I should have had at the start of the episode. But, you know, my dumbass didn't even think to find the freaking key. Oh, there's just there's just gingerbread men in the pool. No big deal. Wow. Okay, I hope this works. Oops, wrong button. I keep pressing. I keep forgetting you have to press start to do this. Okay, now it's unlocked. Okay, now I finally got the house key. That's what I needed to get. Guys in your red men. There. You're still not dead? Bro, stop. Die. <laughs> oh, there's a snake coin. You actually found it? Yeah, I mean, it, it wasn't that hard. Oops. I just had to, um, check the carriage. How's my health doing, actually? That's a good question. Um, yeah, we're fine. The static okay, so isn't that bad. Right now, I'm progressing. Just a bit more. Well, it actually feels good to make some progress now. <laughs> it does feel nice. But do you have any more coins left? Uh, just gotta find the. We just gotta find the prisoner key. Where'd you find that at? Honestly, I have no idea where I found it. Was it outside or was it in a building? <laughs> it was probably outside. I think. Hmm. It was probably somewhere in the pool. 
No, that was the snake coin. <laughs> well, I honestly don't know. Oh, okay. This takes me back to... Well, this takes me to the right side apartments. Actually, yeah, let me see if I can go in here. Okay, I found more handgun bullets. How many bullets do I have? Um, well, I want to, I want to save my bullets. I'll use the plank as much as possible. Oh, I saved this much. I got 60 bullets, apparently. I mean, the gingerbread men aren't that dangerous. The most they'll do is, like, breathe cinnamon breath in your face. <laughs> No, it's more like they just annoy you. Sure, they are pretty annoying. Oh, more bullets. Well, at least you found more bullets. Is this where that guy is? Yeah, here we go. Now I'm wondering how the UFO ending will work. <laughs> Hey Jacob. What? What? Do you still remember the UFO ending from Silent Hill One? <laughs> oh yeah, that was pretty silly. <laughs> it really was. It's literally basically like a joke ending. Oh, let me watch this cutscene. Are you now wondering how the UFO ending will work differently in this game? Bro, I just said I'm watching a cutscene. Oh, okay. You're not friends with that. Is <laughs> that red pyramid thing? Red pyramid thing. I don't know what you're talking about. Honest. But I did see some weird looking monsters. They scared the hell out of me. So I ran in here. <laughs> well, I guess this place isn't too safe either. What happened here anyway? Uh I I told you, I don't know. I'm not even from this town. I just... I just... Alright, another cutscene. Something just brought you here. Right? I was throwing up like crazy. Um, yeah, you could say that. Well, whatever it is, I think you better get out of here soon. Yeah, you're right. About you. I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. Okay, what well, weapon should I use? I, um... You be careful, too. <laughs> Someone tells me this Eddie guy is gonna become a recurring character. You know, I didn't even notice the dead body in the in the kitchen. <laughs> I went in the bathroom first. Well, why not? <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention to that. Okay, so now, uh... Is he gonna give me anything else? Eddie, are you okay? Yeah, I guess. Eddie. <laughs> I don't think he has anything left for me. Is there anything else in here? I could care less about football. Oh, what? Oh, what? What? <laughs> I got a game over! Wait, really? <laughs> I really got a game over! Damn, that's crazy. I literally got... I literally got one hit. Are you not paying attention to your health or something? You know, I just... No, I literally got stabbed. Oh, damn. Mm. 
lock is broken. Okay, well now now I know I need to keep an eye out for uh, getting stabbed. <laughs> that door is barricaded. Oh, I can go in here. Thank goodness I actually saved. Fuck. Stupid gingerbread man, man. These are gonna be like the easiest enemies in the game. You know, later in the game we're gonna have some real crazy enemies. There will be much more crazy enemies. Bullets? Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. And a door that I can't go in. Um... My health is still okay. It's only like, you only really need to worry about your health when you get, when you open the menu and you notice your head is red, or your health is red. That's the only time you really need to heal. Like any other time, you're probably gonna be fine. Okay. Well, the moonness is making progress. Oh, well, that's good. I found the guy thrown up in the toilet. I found the snake coin. And I'll You've made a lot of progress. And I unlocked a door. Okay, now I gotta figure out where to go next. Since you're ahead, I'll, I'll just look it up. So I don't want to get stuck anymore. Alright, let's see. Snake pool... Um, you find Eddie. Alright, let's see. Time to leave Woodside. Um, all that's left is the north stairwell door which you unlock upon investigating, but there's nothing new through here. You should still have a key left, though, so it's time to see what's behind the fire escape door on floor two. Oh, okay. So yeah, I did things out of order then. <laughs> I used the fire escape key before the the freaking courtyard key. Okay, so now we're supposed to go to Blue Creek Apartments. I did the safe combination already. Um, where else do I go? Uh, we have the map of the West Apartment. Um. Enter room 109 on floor 1. Okay. So I gotta go back to the other side of the apartment then. Okay, finally. Where am I now? Okay, that is something that I should have done. Oh, okay, great. This takes me back over here now. Any other tips I should know about for this dungeon? No, I don't think so. No. I guess I can make a save. I got lots of space. <laughs> Only 9 kilobytes for a save, man. Hell yeah. Even though it's not even truly accurate. Hey, at least it's not measured in blocks. <laughs> like on Nintendo consoles. But consoles like the 3DS, the uh, Wii. <laughs> yeah, like what the fuck is a block? <laughs> Block is like a its own unit of measurement in the Nintendo. <laughs> well, that's not the best way to to know about it, but what the heck? Yeah, it's like how who, nobody but Nintendo is gonna measure in blocks. <laughs> Just use kilobytes, bro, or megabytes. Way easier. As far as I'm concerned, a lot of Nintendo saves take up like mostly like 
512 kilobytes to 4 megabytes. Something and sometimes, like that. And sometimes, literally, they're limited. Limited size of gigabytes. That's the highest right now is probably a gigabyte. I don't think, I, I don't think I've ever seen a save that big, though. <laughs> oh, trust me. When you have a gigabyte of worth saves, then yes, it would be huge. I mean, most Switch games only go up to 32 or 64 gigs, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they do. Well, most PlayStation games can go up to hundreds of hundreds of bytes. You know, I'm a bite bite Sony in the ass for charging 700 bucks for a PS5. Okay, so we need to go back to 109. But apparently, there's something in there now. Because apparently, seeing Eddie counts as story progression. Wait, which one's fucking 109? Am I am I going reverse? I think I am. Oops. Is this 109? You know, literally the oh. worst thing about Sony right now is that they are literally gonna charge charge you extra with a console that does that just barely updates of how the console originally was. Yeah, I could care less for the PS5 Pro. Trust me, you should. Okay, so... There's something I can do in here now that, uh... I saw Eddie. Or is there nothing in here? Because, you I... know, inflation and stuff. Did I go in this door already? Oh, I did not. You. And I found more handgun bullets. Yeah. What's that lady from Jeez. earlier? More handgun Angela. bullets. Angela, okay. I don't know what you're planning, but there's always another way. Really? But... Alright, and right now I'm gonna run to the endless it's void. Just to run. <laughs> Besides, yeah, literally, it feels like I am running to the endless void. Yeah, he even said it's easier to run. I know it's easier to run, but even when you run, you're just you're just lost. I'm sorry. It's okay. Where there's smoke, there's always fire. You two poop. She's Where there's smoke, anywhere. they pinch back. Did she live in this apartment building? Even you know what I was saying. <laughs> I don't know. So, all you know is she lived in this town. What did you say? It just makes me wish that I would just go back to the early days of YouTube. Well, I just figured, because this is where you're looking for her. Oh look, more handgun bullets. <laughs> Am I right? And another. I'm so tired. So, why did you come to this town anyway? I I'm sorry. Did did you find the person you're looking for? So right now, not yet. I'm gonna go even further to the endless Her name's void. Mary. She's my wife. I I'm sorry. It's okay. Anyway, she's dead. I don't know why I think she's here. She's mm. dead? Don't worry. I'm not crazy. At least, I don't think so. Uh, I've got to find my mom. Bro might be a little bit crazy. With you? Well, Why? <laughs> now I know what you meant back there in the cemetery. His wife's dead. Yeah, he's trying to look for her anywhere. Anyways. <laughs> okay, yeah, he is going insane. What about that? Will you hold it for me? Sure. No problem. 
If I kept it, I'm not sure what I might do. Oh, nice. I found another health drink. He's got issues. <laughs> yeah, knife. Looks like there's doesn't look like there's anything useful here. Oh, and there's the prisoner coin. Great. There are magazines nice, on the floor. You got a complete set. Yep, so now we can go to that. Now we can go to the prison or the riddle room. Um, okay, well, now, now the only thing I need to left to do is to figure out that puzzle. Oh, yeah, the puzzle. I know how it works. <laughs> you want to just tell me so I can speed things up a little bit? <laughs> okay, so for. So basically what you have to do is that you have to place a specific coin that must be in order. For yeah. example, so for, so for example, uh, the coins actually work differently in each mode. Oh, is it different between easy and normal or something? Yeah, between easy, normal, and hard. Oh, <laughs> so the, the code that you tell me might... Actually, wait, what, what riddle difficulty did you pick? Easy. Oh, well, I picked normal, so it might be a little different then. Oh, I might know. I well, just might. Well, let me try your order anyways and see if it works. No, mine won't even work. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, okay I... that's where I should have went to. Let me try something. I'm going to just try one order, and if it doesn't work, I'll look up this solution. Because it says the seducer is on one end, and then it says, um... Wait, hang on. And then it says on the other end, I think you need to put the snake. Hooray, more handgun bullets. This is probably not the right solution, but I'm going to try it anyways. And then, more health drinks. And we'll put this in the middle. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think that I don't think that's the order. Hmm. Let's see what the actual let's see what the actual order is. Um Oh, here's an interesting thing. It says, if you enter your inventory to take a look at the knife, you'll notice examine on the knife. If you ever examine this knife on multiple occasions, it may influence the outcome of the ending you receive at the end of the game. Interesting. Okay. There's also a ripped photo that I didn't see. Okay, so let's see. Um... You'll notice the following images. An old man, a snake, and a woman. Alright, and what is the order? It's old man, snake, and then prisoner. I think. Oh, wait, no. It's old man, prisoner, and then snake. Wait, I actually almost had it. I actually almost had the order first try. It's just I need to put the prisoner coin one more slot to the left. So you know what? I'm proud of myself. I almost actually solved the puzzle <laughs> on my own. So yeah, there we go. Now is it going to do something? Hmm. Oh wait, no, no. Never mind. I need, they they need to be one more slot over, I think. 
Yeah, okay, hold on. Let me just fix this real quick. Eh, it was like kind of correct. So I guess there is a reason for these uh these five slots because the difficulties change up the puzzles. But the amount of slots never changes, so the difficulty level is a suggestion. It just changes the puzzles each time. Anyways, we got the line house key. And I guess while we're here, we can save. So, where should I go after that? Oh, yeah. It's giving me, like, a whole bunch of reasons on why, uh, these orders are the way they are. Once you've solved the coin puzzle, this secretarial desk will open and reveal the line house key. Directly behind you, the opposite desk, you'll find a small path that leads to the save point. Now with the key to room 209, exit the room and head back up the stairwell. Gotcha. Okay, I will do oh, that. Where are you going to go right now? Alright, we gotta go 209. 209 on the second floor. I, I think, yeah, that was like one of the locked doors. So it looks like you have to find another key. Yeah, which I already have. Yep. There's going to be another key where, where you might find a boss fight. Well, not really a boss fight, but you'll see. I'm assuming that's the thing you got stabbed instantly on? <laughs> yep. That's the one. Huh, let's find out if I die the same way. Nah, you probably won't. You'll figure it out. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, come on. I just know it. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, 209. Literally, I just have a lot of knowledge power. And I have a lot of patchouli knowledge. Yeah, patchouli all the way. Yeah, we like patchouli. As always. Anything, uh, anything in here? No. There's nothing of use here. Okay. And there's another save here. Alright, so we got some bullets. Alright, and it looks like my health has been lowered. And there's a key here. I think that's the key you were talking about. Okay, now I get it. Every time my screen flashes on the character, it looks like I'm dying. Why are you talking about when your screen's red? No, my screen was just flashing. Oh. Well, flashing, uh... I actually don't know if I've ever seen it flashing before. Is there anything even in here? Uh, oh, wait, um... I think I need to go to the stairs. Alright, let's, uh, let's go back in here. There we go, apartment stairway key. Oh, there's Pyramid Head again. Yep, there's Pyramid Head. I'm assuming you got, I'm assuming you got one shot by Pyramid Head. Yep, I hmm. did. You just have to avoid him. Well, I will do that. Yep, like once you... Like once you avoid his really slow attack... 
then you'll be fine, but if landed, then you'll get a game over instantly. Do I need to shoot at him or something? You can't shoot him. You have to make him go into the sewers. sure how I'm gonna do that. It's really easy. <laughs> yeah, because you're playing on easy. <laughs> no, it's because that I just figured it out. Alright, clear I just learned. Right, I just learned head. from my I just learned from my mistake. You have to be behind him. Come here, Pyramid Head. Come here. More health drinks. Fascinating. Alright, come here. Can I push him in? <laughs> You did it? I don't know what I'm- I don't know. Do I have to push him in or something? No, he'll just- No, he'll just go. What do you mean he'll just go? He's not doing that. I t Well, I mean, you just- Well, you could just shoot him. Well, you said I can't shoot him. <laughs> Well, I mean, you can, it's just that he's invulnerable. Wow. Uh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't seem to want to do that. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, now he's going. Weird, I don't know what I did differently that time. Well, it seems like you did it. Yeah, it looks like I did. I don't really know what I did. He just kind of eventually started walking down there. <laughs> I kind of well, just... I kinda, I kinda, sometimes he goes on his own. I kind of just fumbled around for a while, and then he went downstairs. Trust me when I say this. What? I literally just made a huge mistake. What was your mistake? Literally, I just don't know what I was doing. I didn't know what I was doing either. I kind of just like... Well, he kind of like... Stabbed me a little bit. I took a bit of damage. But and then after he like... Damaged me, he went down the sewers. So, yeah. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll make a... I'll just make a quick save state after that. So now we're outside. So the reason what I, what I don't know what I was doing is because that I... I just don't even know if I should just shoot him just to defeat him. He kind of gives me, um, Nemesis vibes from Resident Evil 3. Basically being, Why? Like, basically being like this big tough guy that you can't kill that chases after you. Can I go in here? Nope. Well, pretty much the whole point. So now we're behind Blue Creek Apartment. Oh, it feels good to actually be out of the fucking apartment now. <laughs> I'm so sick of apartments now. 
Trust me, living in an apartment really sucks. I mean, I'm in a townhouse. That's, that's kind of like an apartment, but it's way better. What makes you say that? Because, um, technically I'm not living above or below anybody. You! It was you, wasn't it? You're the one who stepped on my hand. I don't know. Maybe I did. I want to come pick up their like daughter. You doing <laughs> here anyway. Huh? Are you blind or something? What's that letter? None of your business. You didn't love Mary anyway. Wait! How do you know Mary's name? Mm, that's kind of sus. <laughs> but still, someone left their daughter here. That's not a good sign. <laughs> uh, okay, that's the void. I think that's the void that you were running into earlier. And we got some stairs. What could go wrong with a pair of stairs? Uh, we can get. Well, just, we can get. Just hopefully, you know where you're going. All right, it's time for the Lost Woods. Right now, I'm just. Right now, I'm just in a bowling alley. Oh hell yeah, your favorite thing, bowling. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> but seriously, that is the next. That is the next part that you have to go. So this is that park. Hmm. How do you how do you go from a frickin' apartment to a bowling alley? I don't know. Just ask the game developers. <laughs> uh, anything in these pots? Can I check the trash can for uh, free stuff? Who doesn't love free stuff? I love free stuff. Everybody does, you know. Uh, what do we have here? Nothing. Rosewater Park. Well, hopefully I don't miss too many things. Classic camera angle, not being able to see anything. <laughs> Ooh, hey, look, more bullets. Man, we're just finding all the we're just finding all the treasures today, huh? Oh, believe me, there's gonna be a lot of treasures here. And the drinky. More drinks. Yeah, about to get wasted. Every single drink is about to be wasted if we use it all the time. You could just think of them as rations. Oh, the uh, the cutscene broke. <laughs> That's gonna happen all the time. Wait, that happened to you too? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, we should have went to the graphic settings. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with the graphic settings. I just go to the graphic settings just to just to fix the problems. No, you're. If if there are some things that are just bugging you. No, my. Well, now 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 it's working. It just kind of stuttered for a bit. It was weird. I can't believe it. It just froze for me. Maria. I don't look like a uh, ghost, do I? <laughs> See? Feel how warm I am? You're really not Mary. I told you. I'm Maria. Sorry. She had a name change. <laughs> I was confused. Where are you going? I'm looking for Mary. 
Have you seen her? Didn't you say she died? Well, Jacob, you are actually catching up to me. Yeah, Good. three years ago. But I got a letter from her. She says she was. You should be proud. I can I can take it a bit more easy. And that's here. Anyway, I haven't seen her. Yeah, you can just relax. Is this your only? It's no good. This cutscene music's not. pretty relaxing. <laughs> What's a Silent Hill and having like decently calming music at times? <laughs> well, there's the hotel too, I guess. The one on the lake? I well, it's Silent Hill for you. Many things can happen. Yeah, it's still there. So, the hotel was your special place, huh? I'll bet it was. Yeah, why don't you come to my special place and I'll show you what it's I mean. so mad. I was just joking. <laughs> anyway, it's not that way. It's this way. You're coming with me? You were gonna just leave me? No, but... With all these monsters around? No, I just... I'm all She was doing just fine. <laughs> Everyone else is gone. I look like... Mary. Don't I? You loved her, right? <laughs> or maybe... You hated her. Don't be ridiculous. So it's okay? Yeah, fine. <laughs> fine, you can come with me. <laughs> That's what he sounds like. Anything on the bench? Alright, oh, now we have an escort quest. <laughs> In memory of the 67 who died of illness and now sleep beneath the lake. We got some funny lore. Well, that's not funny, but you know what I mean. What's not funny? <laughs> uh, people dying from an illness and then being buried under the lake. Yeah, that is just awful. Yeah, it's quite the opposite of funny, actually. Okay, what do we got over here? Mm. I wouldn't mind a save point. There's probably one coming up soon, anyway. Yep, It'll now, happen eventually. Now we're back to creepy ambience. Have I been here already? Oh yeah, this is the opposite side of the Rosewater Park. Hmm. Over there! Which way is the correct way? Okay, that's the correct way, so let me go back. Just double checking that I didn't miss anything. I don't think you did miss anything. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, and I definitely did. What did you miss, then? I don't know. That's just the thing. I'm always paranoid of missing something in these games. Just don't get paranoid. <laughs> You'll be fine. I mean, I hate to miss something as important as, uh... Oh, how about how about another gingerbread man? I'll, I'll definitely miss that. Oh, I found I found a new map. I'm the map. I'm the map. Yep, I just found the map of the hospital. Wait, we're going to a hospital next? Oh, for sure. Man, what's with Silent Hill games and hospitals? <laughs> I guess, oh, trust me. I guess hospitals just make for really good dungeons, don't they? Oh, they do. It's just that it add, it really adds to the creepy factor. I mean, Persona also has hospital dungeons. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Like, even you go into a hospital as a dungeon in Persona 1. Mm, yep. Oh, there's the bowling center. I see it on the map. Found it? Well, I'm getting there. Oh, okay. I'm just, uh, kind of looking around. Just exploring? 
Yeah, why not? I mean, you never know. There might be some extra, you know, bullets or uh, drinks in the in the, you know out in the open. Well, there might be extra content to it. I mean, I don't know. I'm just looking. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, oh, never mind. This is a dead end. Okay. Well, hey, after the first Silent Hill game, I like to be more thorough. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna fight that guy. Being thorough necessary? Well, I mean, for extra drinks, yeah. Well, you'd be surprised that I have been saving a lot of drinks. Well, let's see, how many drinks do I have? Uh, seven drinks and four medkits. Cool. Alright, so... Yeah, Pete's bowl of rama so that's where Ball you uh, that's so that's where you went next. Oh yeah, I have. Okay. I guess there's something there. Not gonna lie, I prefer the open areas. I prefer like just you know roaming the streets and finding shit more than the dungeon sometimes. Because it's more open. Yeah, it doesn't feel as cramped, I guess. And there's, you know, not as many doors to examine. You're just kind of walking and enjoying it. It's like you want to take your time. Yes, sir. Hey, look, some drinks. And some bullets. Oh, purple bowl key. Texon gas. <laughs> Looks like I found another key. The key! Can I not go in here? Yo, there's like two drinks right in front of this truck. Let's go. See, all that, all that exploring paid off. And it doesn't look like I can go in this truck. That's kind of weird. Well, maybe I can go in one of these buildings. Maybe I can go inside the, uh, the gas station. Never mind, I can't. Alright, we're going back then. No, wait, wrong way, wrong way. <laughs> the camera still confuses me at times. Why? Because <laughs> I can never truly figure out where the fuck I'm going. I'm sure you'll be fine. You just have to adjust to it at this point. Well, now I found a dumpster. Um, I think I'm close to the bowling alley. Already, I'm just adjusting to it. Where's this at? Oh, I think I'm getting close to it. There's also Heaven's Night. <laughs> Whatever that is. Oh, it's a club. A lot of, like, cool empty places here. Okay, I guess there's nothing back here. It's locked. Wait, so what the hell is back here? Is there nothing back here? Alright. Yeah, I guess there's a... Uh... I guess I can't open this gate. So, I don't think there was any reason for me to come back here. Maybe later there will be, but... Not right now. Let's use the good old L2 camera trick so we can keep the camera behind me at all times. 
Which I haven't been it's using. Always... I haven't been using that as much as I would like. It's always nice to use that trick. Yes, sir. I'll wait here. I hate bowling. I didn't come here to play, you know. Hurry back. Okay. Oh, I guess she's gonna stay out while I go do the dungeon. <laughs> Apparently she's not a fan of bowling. She doesn't like bowling. She needs to play she needs to play uh Smash then. Then she'll like bowling. She'll like uh villagers bowling bowling balls. So what'd you do? Robbery? Murder? Nah, nothing like that. When the fuck when the fuck did he get here? You, have to you just magically you? teleported. I thought you said the cops were out for you. No. I just ran because I was scared. Bro's eating pizza in the middle of a bowling alley. I don't know what the cops are doing. There's always pizza in bowling so alleys. Fat. Why don't you just say you're sorry? No, nah, let me eat my pizza. I guess I run away a lot too. It's no good. They wouldn't listen. Nobody I ran away a lot. <laughs> Okay, so I heard the music intensifying. This is really cool, actually. <laughs> well, how could you be so sure? Some good music. It's always nice for Silent Hill to give us music. That is really cool. James, we met in the apartment building? Yeah, I remember, but... Uh... Are you alone here, Eddie? Um, uh, no. <laughs> no? He <laughs> bro said no? No. Yeah, I just went to Hotel Mario. How's he still Wait, only on his first back. pizza? Eddie, let's go after her. Huh? Laura. Maybe the pizza Laura. is endless. Laura, is that her name? That's what she said. It's an endless pizza. This town is full of monsters. All star pizza. How can you sit there and eat pizza? <laughs> she said she was fine by herself. <laughs> How can you sit there and eat pizza? So like me would just slow her down. Forget you. <laughs> Oh look, I found a shotgun. I call shotgun. Who is that girl anyhow? I don't know. All I know is her name. Well, I just found Sorry. it. Why'd that put me behind the table? <laughs> Can I interact with this bowling alley? I think I can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's some bullets at the back here. Cool. This is, that's pretty hard to see, though. I I, I could imagine. I couldn't even imagine what that'd be like trying to play this on a CRT. You could, you could be like what, like one pixel on that TV. Why <laughs> <I have> CRT? <laughs> I mean, I'm playing this on my flat screen TV, and I could barely see that still. Weren't uh, CRT TVs originally four by three? Well, that's what I'm playing this game in. Wait a minute. Wait, I'm just out. I'm just out at the frickin' start of the building. Is that is that all you do in that bowling alley? Yeah. Did a little girl run out of here? Yeah, she was too fast for me. Aren't you gonna? And go I found after another her? key. Where did she go? Hmm. Oh no. Where are you going? This isn't the way that little girl went. 
Oh, well, thanks for letting me know I was going the wrong way. Yeah, honestly, you should do that more often in this game. That'd be nice. <laughs> How could you be so sure if you want to do this more often? It'd be nice if the game oh. told me where I'm supposed to oh, go. Oh, look, they found handgun bullets. Again. She went this way? Oh, nope, nope, not the with that guy. Uh, let me just make, let me just see where I need to go next. Uh, south, west, south Vale. Yeah, okay. Um... Let's see. Head east. Okay, so I'm just supposed to keep going. I'm supposed to keep going this way. At least that's what it seems like. <laughs> There's the inn again. came across a dead end now. How did you end up into a dead end? <laughs> uh, more gingerbread men. Don't care about them. Where am I going? Wait, Saul, Saul Street? Oh, hell yeah. Saul Goodman has his own street in this game? That's sick. I'm sure there are other streets that are named that. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going the right way. <laughs> well, guess we'll uh, guess I'll we'll wander around and we'll look at stuff. You're just gonna wander aimlessly. Yep, that's what I do best. Well, it's not the best option, but sure. Well, I don't know where else the fuck I'm supposed to go. She just said she, you know, she just said the girl ran away. And I don't know where, where that's at. Well, like I said, just go to the hospital. Well, where is the hospital? <laughs> just try to find it. Is it called Heaven's Night? I mean, maybe. Actually, yeah, maybe I'm supposed to go this way. Which direction am I facing now? Yeah, let's just keep heading this way. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll loop around and find it. Man, this fog, this fog filter goes crazy. Trust me, it does go crazy over time. Hello? What the fuck is all this doing in the way? What's all this nonsense? There's a, just a giant barricade in the way. That's really convenient. Okay, what if we go down this street? Is there anything down here? Nope, another barricade. Oh man, Silent Hill loves that. With it where like the road is just like completely broken off and you can't go to where you need to go. Well, I hear more gingerbread men, but they can't catch me. I'm- I'm the real gingerbread man. Where have I heard that before? <laughs> oh. What about this- what, what's this pathway? Jack's Inn. 
kind of reminds me of Jack Off. <laughs> like the funny game mode from D Party. <laughs> I haven't even played D Party in <laughs> months. Well, let me know when you want to play that again, because I'm always down for some D Party. Well, okay. Yeah, I'm dumb. Where the fuck do I go now? Well, let's let's keep exploring. I probably went no I probably went I probably went there for no reason. I think um uh, well, whenever the next street is, I'll uh, go down there. Oh wait, no, this is the tech. This is the freaking gas station again. <laughs> How did you end your end yourself up to a gas <laughs> station? Oh my me, I'm just exploring. Let's try going this way again. Shit, <laughs> there's nothing here. What about back here? Is there anything here? Nope, this is just the gas station again. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it, I'm back at the gas station again. How many times are you gonna go to the gas station? Frick you, gas station. Okay, what if I go, um... Well, here's the thing. It won't let me go past. It won't let me go past this point. I don't think. Wait, can I go in here? Oh, I can't even get in that. I can't even get through that gate. Hmm. Wait. Now it's letting me go this way? Weird. Uh, let's see, we have the Silent Hill Historical Society. Oh, that might actually, that might be the, um, the hospital. More health drinks. It doesn't sound like a hospital, though. Why not? I don't know. Sounds more like uh, a history center or something. <laughs> well, I could tell you a fact that it's really not. <laughs> but hey, we found the uh, we found the hospital, so that's good. Here's the historical society. You're but, making progress. That's it, for sure. But it's locked. I can't get inside the hospital. Well, it looks like you have to find the key. Hmm. Oh, I'll find the key somewhere, I'm sure. <laughs> well, this leads to the Paleville 26 County. Someone tells me I'm not supposed to go this way, though. Unless the key is in here somewhere. Oh, dang. A dead end. Oh. Hey, Gingerbread Man. How's it going? <laughs> I love how they just kind of pop out of nowhere. <laughs> That's what usually happens. Yeah, I love it. Well, I'm trying to figure out how to get a key for the hospital now. Now I'm going to go to... The third floor. Hmm, that's confusing. Where could that key be? Um... Hello, key, where are you? Let's see what else I'm supposed to do. Where am I supposed to go? Uh, 
Uh, oh, I'm supposed to go to, um, I'm supposed to go to that gate where the, uh, bowling alley is. I see, I see. Okay, that, make, that makes more sense now. Found out? Yeah, I found out. <laughs> I was wondering why that gate didn't serve a purpose before, and now it suddenly does. Okay, so they weren't stopping me from going to the hospital, but I can't get in the hospital until I do this. So that makes sense, I guess. Okay, it sounds like the music is intensifying. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. I'm not there yet, though. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's go with this. Let's go back here. So we need to go, um... This is where, why we need to go back here. Okay, and then... Not sure exactly where we need to go back here. Probably this side. Here we go. She went through there. Is there any other way? Yeah, there is. Right through there. That door. It's no good. It's locked. Yeah, magically she just has the three keys to this door. <laughs> that makes a lot of fucking sense. <laughs> Alright, well thanks, mystery woman, for unlocking the door for me. That door is locked. Looks like there's gonna be a ton of locked doors. Flower vase. Hmm. How fascinating. Looks like the lock is broken. Dang, what's with the frickin', like, chill-ass, like, lo-fi music in here? <laughs> Why lo-fi specifically? <laughs> I don't know, that just came to my mind. Hey, there's drinks on the table. Cool. Regular stage. My question is, why would she come to a frickin' strip club? Actually, no. She didn't go in the strip club. What am I talking about? <laughs> okay. So now we're... Now we're out here. So where are we now? Oh, oh, Heaven's Night is the name of the, uh, Heaven's Night is the name of the strip club, of okay. The, of the club? Yeah, now I see. Makes sense. Well, I wasn't expecting to be here now, but hey, cool. You're just surprised? <laughs> Can I go in the truck? Dang, I can't go in the truck. See, now, after Silent Hill 1, I'm just expecting, like, every truck to be enterable and just have, like, a safe point and some ammo inside. <laughs> no, it doesn't work that way. Over there. Oh, there's the hospital. Told you. It doesn't even have a name. It's just there. So is, this, every single, so is this the next dungeon every in the game or something? Games.
Brookhaven Hospital. Well, so it does have a name. It's just not marked on the map. Hmm. Honestly, this place might be a little more tolerable than the uh, the apartments. At least, every, be so at least every like room has a proper name. You know, like the pharmacy, the director room. All right, let's just. <laughs> Let's just test out every door and see which one is locked and which one isn't. Because, uh, in true Silent Hill fashion, 90% of the doors are just there as decoration. <laughs> I'm pressing the buttons, but the door doesn't move. Wow, look at- guess what, guys? All the fucking doors don't work. Oh, that one does. Okay, so do we want to go into the basement? Oh, there's nothing down there. Well, I don't have a I don't have a map to the second floor, do I? Enemies are definitely getting more dangerous. Ooh, oh yeah, I'm not doing too good here. Well, it seems like you're having trouble. I'm getting uh, jumped by these weird hospital monsters. Alright, well, looks like I have to backtrack. How long do you guys take to die? Jeez. It's clear by this point I should probably stop using the frickin' wooden plank then. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to get the roof key. Yikes. <laughs> Alright, let's use a drink. There we go. Okay. Um, I'll just... I'll just make saves whenever I feel like. Okay. Let's switch to the handgun then, because we're gonna start- we're gonna- we're, we're not gonna want to use, uh, those bullets anymore. That door is locked. That door is also locked. This one's unlocked. The locker won't open. There's a magazine here that won't do me any good. Crap. There we go. That's what I need to do. Can I open any of these lockers? There's something inside the pocket of the white lab jacket. I got the examination ring key. Oh, cool. There's nothing else in there, is there? The men's locker room. There's also the woman's locker room, which also has stuff in it, I guess. There's a teddy bear. Ow. What's wrong? I just pricked myself. Are you okay? Yeah. Ew. <laughs> I got the bent needle. Oh, yo, the shotgun. There you go. There's a bag. Now you found the shotgun. Let's go. Okay, so... Done that. So we got a bunch of different rooms to go to. Like the day room. Huh, that's weird. I wonder if I should save the shotgun, though, for bosses. Oh, that's, that's the elevator. Mm -hmm. 
Oh shit. Okay, I can use the I can use the plank on these guys. These guys aren't that threatening. Okay, I didn't expect that to happen. Hmm, what did you do wrong this time? Pyramid Head just pushed me. Pyramid Head pushed you? <laughs> yeah, he actually did. What the fuck? I just fell down like three stories up. Wow, that's wild. But somehow he's a he's still standing up. Wow. Wow. Oh, wait, I can go in here. Alright, um... Oh, yeah, the examination room key. I don't know what I need this nail for yet. But I guess we'll find out later. Oh, yeah, look at that. I got more handgun bullets. Okay, uh, let's make another save. Just because I, I'll know I'm making progress if I keep saving every few minutes. First aid kit. Hey, I mean, it's a hospital. Of course there's going to be a lot of uh, first aid kits in here. Nothing interesting. Okay. Uh, M1. Looks like the lock is broken. Bath 2. The lock is broken. Oh, wow. Oh, I can go in M2. I got the lapis eye key and some shotgun shells. Very nice. Okay. Um, I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna go take a piss. But... Um, yeah, we'll be, we'll be, I'll be back with some Silent Hill 2 in a sec. You want me to wait? Nah, you can keep going. Okay, if you say so. Alright, so I'm not mining the hospital too much so far. The hospital is, uh, pretty chill, honestly. Why is it chill to you? Um, I don't know, just because of the fact that I'm not lost so far. <laughs> Well, it sure seems like you're not lost. Jesus Christ, these freaking, like, hospital dudes, they take so long to die. Still not dead yet, huh? Okay. I mean, that's just how you know... That's just how you tell if, um, the enemies are dead, is if the music stops or not. <laughs> oh. There's more of them? Still kicking? Alright. Yeah, it seems like I'm not sure where to go. Got a bullet, and we got some drinks. 
Yeah, I mean, I used a lot of freaking bullets there. Look at that. Now I'm down to 115. <laughs> I went from like a hundred, like forty to a hundred fifteen. <laughs> Probably why you should play this game on easy, because the enemies just they just tank a crap ton of uh, ammo <laughs> if you're playing on normal mode. Oh shit! I'm getting some red stats. Okay. I wasn't even aware that I was dying. Kind of hard to tell if you're dying, honestly. Okay. Yeah, it's really not easy to tell, to be honest. There's a cover over the elevator button. M4 is broken. M5 is broken. M6 is unlocked. Okay. You know this game could use a quick swap button. <laughs> that way I can switch to um the plank if I need to. Alright, now okay. we're Ooh, shotgun shells. I guess at this point they're they're expecting you to start using the shotgun. But I don't wanna I don't wanna use the shotgun. There we go. I'm gonna stick with the handgun until I ran out of bullets. That, I guess that's it. That's everything in this room. Alright. Right now I'm gonna use another key. There's nothing useful here. So it looks like that's everything on the second floor so far. Yeah, look at that, guys. I already made a lot of progress. I did like all these M rooms, whatever the M means, I don't know yet, but we did it. And there's also elevator. So let's go back. Fortunately, we gotta kill these stupid doctor nurse bandage thingies. So yeah, unfortunately, I don't have a funny name for these. I don't have a funny name for these enemies. I'm just gonna run past. I mean, honestly, that's probably what you should do. You, you, sh you sh that's what you should be doing. You shouldn't, um, you shouldn't be killing the enemies. You should just like stun them and then run, <laughs> because you're gonna waste your bullets that way. So where can we go now? I guess we can go in the, we can go back downstairs. I didn't finish exploring the first floor, so I should probably do that. But I did get a few keys, so that's something cool. <laughs> so I was gonna just respond to a freaking Paper Mario screenshot I sent of me having 33 BP. <laughs> and he said, not enough, you need 69 BP. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because for anybody who doesn't know, uh, in my Paper Mario ROM hack, I managed to increase the BP cap. So, it's not 30 anymore now, it's, uh, 99. The lock is broken. Now, y'all need to fix your doors around here, jeez. Okay. Oh, I can go in here. Oh, this is the save room. Anything in here? Ooh. Cool. We can actually save the game properly. Alright, save complete. Oh, and there's a drink here. Yay! Health drink. You can never have too many of those. Oh, there's also the document room. Different types of papers. Okay. Wait, what, what did I just do? 
The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman will be driven like him to the other side. The other side, perhaps, may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there's no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I'm a doctor, not a philosopher, or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to use us, to, to us that his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind. But to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he's happy there. So why, I ask myself, why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? Something else is written. I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key to that box. I got the purple bowl key. Oh, cool. So, good thing I came in here, then. I'm just gonna make a crap ton of saves. I don't even know how many saves there are, you're allowed to have. But, I don't really care. Well, who knows what that purple bowl key does. But, at least I have it now. Oh wait, I have the uh I have the door to the exam room. Which one was the examination room again? Oh, it's on this side, okay. There we go. Well it's a good thing I went to the second floor first. There are medical records. So nothing in here. Could this even be considered music? It's just like... I don't know. One note being repeated over and over. <laughs> uh... Nothing to examine on this desk? Hmm. Well, I can tell you one thing. This game is breaking a law. <laughs> because it's not allowed- you're not allowed to have the Red Cross in games. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. Oh, wait. Did I never go? I didn't go to exam room one, I don't think. Aha. Wait, no. Wrong, wrong door. The lock is broken. Okay, I'm just making sure I can't go in there. So we got that unlocked. We haven't been not we have not been to the kitchen or the day room yet. Alright, who is the genius playing this one note over and over? They need to fire this man. <laughs> the, the the composer for the uh Well not the actual composer, but like this imaginary, um, guy that's hiding in the hospital. He's just playing this one note over and over again. He thinks he's funny. Mm -hmm. The lock. That's all, that's locked. That's broken. Oh, so I can't even get into the kitchen because there's shit in the way. Yeah, this is as far as I can get. Well, that's the day room that I tried to go into. Okay, so that, that stuff's all blocked off, so screw that noise. So we're actually done on this floor for right now. Unless I can get in the, uh, unless I can get into this door. That's locked still. Okay, well, what if we went to the third floor then? Because, uh, I could probably go up there. Yeah, floor number three. So this is how you get over here. Okay, now I am very lost. Well, can't help you much there, because I'm probably still behind. <laughs> I'm just trying to unlock a friggin' treasure chest. Come on, camera, work with me here. 
That shit's small. Oh. Oh shit. My girl died, bro. <laughs> Dang, I got a game over because my fucking stupid girl got in the way. <laughs> How did you get a game over? She got in the way, bro, and then the fucking doctor guys pimp slapped her. <laughs> that was not my fault, bro. Her fault for getting in the way. Oh, I already did this. So I didn't miss anything else, did I? Well, I guess I got a game, my first game over too, but I got a game over in an even stupider way than you did. Because <laughs> at least in your case, you didn't know that Pyramid Hill was going to one-shot you. <laughs> to my knowledge, there's nothing else on this floor anyway. Oh wait, no, I gotta do the freaking exam room again. Damn it, I should have saved. Yeah, great, I gotta do this shit again then. Okay, I'll make a save once I get to the third floor then. Get my uh, shotgun shells. Actually, I think that's everything here. That lock is broken. Hmm. Wait, hang on. Third floor patient wing hall, 7335. Okay. Maybe that's what you needed to come in here for, just get that passcode. Hey, how long have we been streaming? Uh... Oh wow, two hours. Has it really been two hours? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> you want to end off? Mm. I mean, are you anywhere near a safe point? No, not really. I'm just trying to figure out this freaking treasure chest. Well, I mean, I could probably keep going for like another 10 or so minutes. Oh, well, okay. Or you can stop and you can let me catch up. <laughs> at least, I at am least... stopping. It's just that I'm trying to figure out this damn treasure chest. Hmm. Well, let me, uh... Let me go in this... Let me go back up to the third floor. Yeah, like, I'm actually, I'm actually having a better time now. Because now I'm not fucking stuck in the stupid apartments anymore. I'm actually, like, making some progress. Okay. Let's make a save state here, because, uh... The game decided to be smelly. Five, six... Seven, eight, nine, ten... 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15 hits for those fuckers. Jeez, why do they take so much? That's what I'm saying, why? Why do they take so many? Oh, I can go in here. Oh, this is the, uh, there's a passcode here. Do I need to put in the passcode I found earlier? 7335. Got him. 
I'm not sure what this treasure chest that you're talking about is, but I, if, if it's giving you that much trouble, it's probably gonna be a bitch. The lock is broken. Mm, I gotta try out all these frickin' doors. <laughs> Oh, we can go in S3. Hmm. hmm I actually have a cutscene in here. James. <coughs> Wait a minute. <coughs> I'm kind of tired. Yeah, why don't you rest in here and stop getting in my way? <laughs> It's just a hangover. You should rest. Wait, there's a key on the table. Mm. <clears throat> so comfy. I'm gonna go look for her. For Laura. I can't imagine that mattress is that can. comfy. I got the roof key. I'll be okay soon. <coughs> Did you find Laura? <laughs> no, I haven't even started yet. <laughs> well, apparently, you know, back in back in my school, we had a we had a stereotype that apparently the Americans they don't they say the weird they they say the word roof weird. <laughs> they don't say roof, they say roof. <laughs> roof. Yeah. <laughs> well, but, uh, it's a pretty silly stereotype, though. It is a stupid one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it's not even accurate at all. It really isn't. Are you dead yet? here something weird in this can there's something stuck in the drainage pipe the hole's too small i can't get my hand inside okay. to reach it maybe if i had a long narrow tool of some kind um what about what about the plank nah what about the uh what about the nail it isn't long enough fuck Hey, at least they- hey, at least they thought of that. Okay, uh, let me equip the plank for this guy, because this guy is pretty easy to kill. That looks nothing like the number five. Is oh, that puzzle giving you shit or something? Yes, because literally the numbers were not even clear. Oh. Yeah, I was trying... I was trying to find a way to open the freaking... the freaking locks. Oh. Yeah, somebody tells me I'm probably gonna have that same problem then. Trust me, it's awful. The log is broken. S10 isn't even accessible. <laughs> oh, S11 is though. Hey, there's a health drink and a save in here. Let's go. Hmm. Well, hey, I found a, I found a legit save point, so I think this might be a decent place to stop. Let me just uh, let me just write some things down then, so I don't forget. Um. Oh, and also my health isn't doing too good. There we go. That's better. 
Let me just overwrite that save. So my save file is at 2 hours and 54 minutes, apparently. Hmm, doesn't sound too accurate, but whatever, I'll take it. Alright, well anyways, guys, thanks for watching Silent Hill 2 for today. We made some, we made some pretty decent progress. I think in the next episode, we will finish up the, um... We'll finish up the hospital, probably, and then maybe s do a few other things. But I don't. Well, hopefully, I don't, I don't want to make the. the I don't want to make this a uh, trend where we like get halfway into a dungeon and then just stop because that uh, won't be fun at all. I don't want a repeat of this episode where I got stuck for half an hour trying to figure out where to go. <laughs> at least this time, I have a better idea on where I need to go because I have like a few keys that I haven't even used yet. So I shouldn't get lost next episode, but we'll we'll see. <laughs> what idea do you have? I have um like the purple bowl key, and I think I have the lapis key. All right. So I have a few keys that I can use, and I haven't even explored all of this floor yet. So there there's still some stuff I can do at least. But yeah, uh, we will see you guys in the next episode.